Hey YouTube, Pipe Gentleman here. Uh, I guess I was in a nostalgic mood tonight because I am smoking uh, the first ever pipe that I purchased. Just a little straight Italian uh, scoop, uh, sandblast. It's, uh, I believe that's called a P lip, I believe. Hmm. It was actually my father who got me into pipe smoking. I had always kind of been interested in it before, but, um, uh, when I came home one, uh, one year, I noticed that he had some pipes, uh, near his desk, and he, uh, he asked me if I wanted to smoke a pipe with him, and I said, absolutely. I'd always been interested in it before, as I said. I'd seen, um, I'd seen some videos online, and of course, the movies. It's kind of, it's not a very good thing to say that I'm so influenced by movies, but Lord of the Rings, Sherlock Holmes. It's a really great little pipe, you know. Um, I bought it about a month after my first time smoking a pipe with my father. It, uh, I actually found it like some of my other pipes in a uh, in an antique shop. This was about thirty dollars, I think. Kind of odd because the Savinelli was only five dollars, so. And I'm pretty sure Savinelli's a better brand than this pipe is. This If you're curious as to what I'm smoking tonight, I'm smoking um uh Nording's Hunter's Blend Labrador. I'll do a review on that later. I won't tell you anything about it. I'm just gonna let you know what I'm smoking tonight. Uh, the pipe's really great. Um, it's got a nice smooth draw, big bowl, big enough I could fit about half my thumb into it. Um, concerns about the pipe? Uh, there is a crack here on the side, and I'm sure I could have it fixed. Um, if I take it to my tobacconist, they could probably take a look at it or send it away. Uh, the wood itself, it's kind of light. Uh, I could tell it doesn't feel as dense as my other pipes. You know, my other pipes are a little heavier. Even though uh, some of them are about the same size. So I can tell it's, yeah, it's not as dense. And it does get a little hot. Um, it gets hotter quicker than other pipes do. For my first pipe, I had to learn, as I mentioned in my first video, I'm a bit of a speed puffer, so I had to learn to slow down with this pipe or else I could burn myself. You know, it took me a few tries to kind of learn to slow down and enjoy the pipe and not just smoke through it. By the way, I'm about two-thirds of the way through Still Life with Woodpecker. Again, not going to say anything about that. You're just going to have to wait for the uh, for the video review of that. So, yeah. No real reviews tonight. Just uh, reminiscing over uh, my first pipe, feeling nostalgic. So...